Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In today's video, we will talk about adding three fractions. So without further ado, let's do this topic. So what we have here is that we are given the direction, add the following fractions, and simplify. In the first example, we have 1 over 5 plus 2 over 10 plus 1 over 6. So what we need to do now is to find what is the LCD of 5 10 and 6. So for us to know about the LCD, we need to get the least common multiple between 5, 10, and 6 by listing its least common multiples or the multiples of 5, 10, and 6. So for 5, we need to list down all the multiples of it which are 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, and so on. And next, we have the 10. This done all the multiples of 10. We have 10, 20, 30, 40, and so on. Next, let's list down all the multiples of 6. And these are 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, and so on. And as you can see, we can easily identify which is the least common multiple between 5, 10, and 6, and this is 30. Now, this 30 will serve as the LCD of 5, 10, and 6. Now, what we need to do next is we will think of number that we need to multiply by 5 to make it 30. And definitely that is 6. We will multiply the, the denominator 5 by 6 and also its numerator. And what about 10? So what do you think is the number that we need to multiply to make it 30? Let's count this one. 1, 2, 3. So we will multiply this by 3 and also this by 3. Here, same pattern, guys. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. And for 6 to make it 30, you will multiply it by 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And 5. So what will happen? It will become like this. 1 times 6 is 6 over, this is definitely 30. Plus 2 times 3 that is 6 over 30. And as you can see, they have the same denominators because it's easier for us to add fractions if they have similar or same denominators. Here, we have plus 5 over 30. Now, look at the numbers. We have these numbers. Okay, so what's next is that we will add them. 6 plus 5 is 12 plus 5, that is 17 over 30. So do you think, can you still simplify 17 over 30? Okay, that's the simplified form already. So our answer here is 17 over 30. Now let's move on with item number 2. For number 2, we are given the denominators 5, 2, and 4. We will list down its multiples to find what is the LCD. So for 5, we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, and so on. Next is 2, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. So as of now, wala pa tayong common. 14, 16, 18, 20. We will stop here first, and so on. And for the 4s, the multiple of 4 are 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, and so on. And as you can see, we have its least common multiple, which is the 20. 1, 
this one, and this one. So we will th be thinking, what are we going to multiply by 5 to make it 20? So let's count 1, 2, 3, 4. We will multiply this by 4. And also this by 4. And as for the 1 half, we will multiply by 2 by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. And as for this, 3 over 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Multiply this by 5. And also this by 5. Now, let's solve them. 2 times 4 is 8. Over 20. Plus, this is 10. Over 20. Plus, 3 times 5 is 15 over 20. So as you can see, add them since they have the same denominators naman. 6 plus 10 is 18 plus 15 that is 33 over your denominator which is 20. Now as you can see, our answer is an improper fraction. By the way, if your teacher is asking you to convert this into a mixed number, because sometimes some of the teachers are not accepting mix, uh, improper fraction, so we will express this into a mixed number. This is 33 over 20, or express this into mixed number. We will divide 33 by 20. 33 divided by 20 is 1. 1 times 20 is 20. And this is 13. So as you can see, this is your mix, uh, whole number. Your numerator is 13. And it's for your denominator, that is 20. So these are the possible answers for item number 2. So as part of our routine, I will give you another example for you to answer. And I hope na makita natin sa ating comment section what is your answer after adding the three fractions? For item number three, I will let you answer this. 2 over 3 plus 1 over 6 and plus 5 over 8. So that's it guys. I hope you learned something from this video. And by the way, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe but hit the bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Gorn. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!